What about you? Tell us about you. How did you get to Range to becoming a co-founder of Range? Because I, I see you have a mixed background. You, you've been, you've done some teaching, <laughs> you've done some management consulting, um, and you've been in people ops. So a, a great blend of of skills there that have brought you to be now um, co-founder of Range. Tell us how you got to 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 uh, Range. Yeah, I I think like many people. You know, when you you look back at your your background, you're like, huh, I did do a variety of things, but they all kind of made sense at the time. I'm originally from a, a manufacturing town in Georgia in the United States. And so grew up in kind of a very different world from from Silicon Valley and ended up out here after kind of graduate school in political economy and doing some financial consulting and was really interested in this question of how you build an effective culture and an effective company and started doing some consulting with companies kind of from the the YCs of the world or kind of much larger tech companies as well. And ended up going in house at a company called Medium, which is a blogging platform Mm -hmm. where I led our organization design and where I met one of my co-founders, Dan, he was leading engineering at the time and ended up teaming up with our third co-founder, Braden, who's out of Google Ventures, where he led the design sprint process. And it's been interesting, I think, Growing up in a manufacturing town to where I am now, there's certain ways of working that are very traditional and in many ways established because they've been successful at at running large companies in different ways. But what we all observed at many of the tech companies and the way larger companies was shifting was a shift towards distributed or remote work, a shift towards more innovation and autonomy on the teams where individuals are making more decisions, an increased need for strong, high bandwidth communication, uh, caring about culture and engagement. And we really saw a gap between those needs and the tools that teams were using. And that's what led us to build the team success platform that is Range today. 